the nature of television is that if you're doing six episodes, as we are to, to start with this time, um, you obviously can't have episode one in the 20s and episode three and four in the 50s because the audience get confused. And, you know, I think, um, I mean, I grew up in the 50s. I mean, I was born in 1943, so I was um, seven in 1950 and 17 in 1960. I remember the 60s quite well. And I think it's a very appropriate time in which to introduce a, a new television audience to these two wonderful characters. And I'm looking forward to it. These are spy stories in general, certainly the ones we've been filming, um, The Secret Adversary and NRM. And it just really fitted um, because you've got the Cold War, you've got this sort of invisible threat of, of the Soviets, communism, call it what you like. And... Um, it felt like a really great, you um, know, great time frame, and also I think it's not over familiar. Some time frames you constantly come back and back and back, and for example, the nineteen twenties, brilliant, you know, because of the music and the fashions and everything. But we've just felt, let's try and do something a little surprising and 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 set them in the uh, in the fifties. I like the slight sense of struggle about it because there was a lot of poverty post the Second World War, and I quite like the idea that. Uh, you know, Tommy and Tuppence are not living the high life in the way that they might have been maybe in the 20s. I know that's after the First World War, but it seems like a very opulent time, and the 50s doesn't. Um, so it's a slightly grim period. And we did, the, we did these um, scenes the other day, which were set in the smog in London, because the smog in London in the 50s actually killed people. And uh, it was just brilliant. And, and, uh, and I just thought, you really, you know, I've really not seen, seen this represented on TV, you know, any time recently. So... Hopefully people will embrace the time period and, and really get to enjoy it.